here with the wonderful Sam Blake at the Digital Life Show. Sam's shooting X-Pro1. Um, Sam, I guess, uh, is one of those photographers, I feel, that uh, is the, the new inspiration in wedding portrait work and a lot of documentary, um, a lot of connection with the bride and groom, whereas perhaps before weddings it's been a little bit more stylized. Can you tell me a little bit about that, that journey and how you see your journey with photography and the connection with people? Yeah, um, I guess the um, main thing I'm drawn to in my work is um, just capturing real stuff in a wedding rather than something fake and artificial. Um, and by doing that, just learning to connect better with the client so they drop their guard and show who they really are. And you use certain techniques for that or you as a person can connect holistically with people, do you feel? I mean, how do you how do you do that? I mean, some photographers stand back, but you seem to almost encompass or you're part of, of their their wedding. Is, is that something that you've learnt over the years or is it just a natural natural ability? Yeah, um, it's multiple different things. Um, a lot is just, um, just being real myself rather than um, pretending to be someone I'm not. I'm just, um, I don't pretend to be anything uh, else. But there's also other techniques I've learned um, by my good friend Jess Jerox. He's um, taught me some beloved techniques which um, I use and have implemented my own and in more that philosophy and style of shooting is um, just learning to ask, be generally interested in the people and asking them questions at that um, helps create a bond and trust. It creates a space for them to, to be themselves. I know Jesh was shooting with uh, X100 when he was out here and, and you uh, initially started shooting with X100, I believe, Japan, was it? Yes. So, so that was, uh, tell me a little bit about that. I think you were telling me that, um, I think you went out shooting with a camera and then ran back and got the X100 and that was it, was that right? Or? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, um, I shoot a lot of medium format film for my, prefer my personal work and um, I had, on my Mamiya 6 and when I was in Japan I was shooting with my X100 every day because it was so easy to go out and just shoot and shoot stuff like we film it obviously you know it's what four dollars a click so you have to be very careful about you know you, you compose and you think more about the images which is a different way of shooting compared to shooting digital and especially like an X100 where you can, you know, no sh basically no noise, be a lot more inconspicuous. So I had shot the first few days of my trip on the X100 and I was getting frustrated that I wasn't shooting any film work. So one day um, packed up all um, my Mamiya and made it about 50 metres down the road. It was already too heavy and quickly ran back to the hotel room, dumped my film gear and just took my X100 out again. Then I just realised that trip was just about shooting on a smaller camera and... and being fluid and letting, and just letting things evolve. exploring a different style of shooting than I was not normally doing. And, and now, obviously shooting X-Pro1, it's probably as well as other cameras on weddings, are you finding that product within your commercial work, if you like, or work that you earn money from, um, mm -hmm. is that giving you the same freedom? Yeah, the thing I really like about um, shooting the X-Pro1 at weddings is it's not as intimidating um, putting the camera up in front of my face than one of my digital SLRs. So in times where I'm trying to create images um, that are more, a bit more intimate or um, trying to get something a bit more vulnerable out of the bride, when I hold up a big massive camera, it's they freak out, you know, if you have a 80, 85 or 70 to 300 on, it's big and scary. But having just a smaller, little camera, it feels like a friend's camera, or the camera that, the size of camera that they're used to. So they don't get as anxious or yeah. something, I find, yeah. and they yeah. just relax more. So. Yeah, no, it's quite, uh, I mean, that message is sort of coming through, I guess, with a lot of people, and uh, certainly the weight of DSLRs, and carrying those things around, and you're obviously, you know, not a muscle man, and even older. I think these older people that are around, it's, uh, yeah, it's certainly a great, 
great product for that. So, yeah. Thank you for uh, joining us. Thank you for allowing us to use your images and talk to photographers. We really appreciate it. Uh,